Hey guys, um, it's another day right now. Couldn't get it done yesterday. And right now I'm about to cut up the old standing platform, casting platform, and use that to reinforce the back, like a top layer. So I'm about to cut these. There's another panel over there to be able to fit that. So let me get to it. Okay, I, as you guys just saw, I just finished up. I'm gonna, I will clean this up. It looked a lot nicer yesterday. When I repaint the, this on the boat, let's see. Yep, there you go. Perfect. Yeah, I just realized something. I accidentally used um, the holes for the handles as one of the uh, drill holes, so that's gonna be fun. Gotta fix that. What I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna take my drill and I'm gonna make little marks on the back of these holes so I can go over there and actually I'll probably use the Sharpie but I'll go over there and I'll drill a hole through them so yeah <laughs> Just got it in. So, time to take it out, um, hit with the shop back, clean it off, and then go ahead and seal it in. Okay, guys, what I got, currently have to do is set up eight, no, yeah, eight bolts like this, where there's a washer and then um, a rubber washer. And then put them right here to put attach the transom. This is gonna waterproof it to um, prevent any water from getting in. Let's get to it. Okay, so. Yeah, I, I just got to be really careful with this stuff. Also, while handling um, this COSA board, I recommend always wearing gloves. And making sure your stupid wires are out of the way. Now's the moment of truth. Make sure all of these are out of the way. And 
see most of the washers. So I'm gonna stick the bolts through these top ones at least. So now it's going to be these bottom ones. Crap, I lost one. Okay, I'll take this off. Okay, got it all. Two more to go. Last one. Good. Now, the transom pieces. This one's more of a problem. Okay, so what I gotta do guys is put a washer and a spacer on each of these to be able to and then start drilling them down with this. So I'll get to it. Yeah guys, I just reached Mac stupidity. So I'll show you guys what I did. I was about to chalk it, but then I realized I used this is the hole that originally is for the handles. I used one. I had to just do that. I used one as my uh, point. But honestly, it is a pretty good looking transom. And it's going to be strong. That's, that is stuck there. That ain't going anywhere. But yeah. So I got to go put the handles back on. Fun times. Okay. So now I'm going to, along these edges, caulk. So, to better seal this all in, especially right here, just make sure you just don't want to get in there. So, yeah. Okay. So, now I'm going to, along these edges, caulk. So, to better seal this all in, especially right here, just make sure you just don't want to get in there. So, yeah. As you guys can see, I'm slowly losing daylight. So I'm gonna probably wrap it up. It ain't the prettiest thing, but this thing will be strong. You can hear that, it does not stop. No, that is attached. Yeah, it ain't pretty. I'm gonna have to rough this. I'm gonna have to put a layer on top of this. Caulking job's ugly as crap, but yeah. So, anyway, that's good. Um, not this, not this weekend, but the next weekend we'll be working on this back and finishing the front. So, and then two weeks from then, we'll be doing the um, platforms. So, please like, subscribe, and share. Check out um, some of the fishermen fishing YouTube channels in the description and keep on fishing.